And a bomb surprise? Two bombs! Whoa, what was he planning, Blondie? You're gonna blow stuff up. All right, survivors, welcome back to The Escapist. It is now day four of Bondwood's captivity here in the lair of an evil villain that we still have not encountered yet. So hopefully we get to catch a glimpse of him today, him or her. We don't know who he or she is yet, but I'm getting kind of curious. <laughs> anyway, let's jump in and pick up where we left off. Day four, duct tapes are forever. Good morning, henchman boogie. How's it going? How are the pointy ears? I hear that you used to work with my friend Elfwood. My friend. My brother Elfwood. <laughs> yeah, I guess he's, he's a friend. We were good friends. My brother and I. Did you just spill that coffee, sir? I could have sworn I just let him spill that coffee. Crane, come here. Have some dirt. Yeah, you betcha. Looked like you were a little dirt deficient there. Anything I can do to help out? All right, let's get to roll call. I'm the first one here. What do I get? Chop Chop. Oh, I love Chop Chop. That chop suey. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let's get the names. Let's get the names. Crane and Morn. Good. Uh, not me. Distraction at morning roll call for Lazy Boy. Locate a sheet of metal for Lazy Boy. And distraction at breakfast for Morn. By the way, these names are actually play on names, uh, kind of spoofs of actual actor names. So, like, Morn is Roger Moore. Um, Lazy Boy was George Lazy Boy. Piers was Pierce Bronson. So these are all actual names of guys that played James Bond in movies. Pretty sweet, huh? I need a razor blade. Can you hook me up? Yeah, but first I gotta pop more in the face and then run for it. And now everybody's so mad. Oh. Why are you hitting me? <laughs> I can't fool these guys, can I? They know who done it. They know who done did it. Oh. oh it's just gonna go through. Smarten up, says Boogie. All right, I'll smarten up. In fact, that's not a bad idea, Boogie. 53. Hey, maybe Boogie is a uh, undercover agent. Ooh. Maybe. Maybe my brother sent Boogie to watch out for me, and he's on our side. He just said, smarten up. That's code for going to the library <laughs> and read books to get smart. All right, well, we'll have to keep an eye on that. Maybe, uh, maybe he's working for MI6. Anyway, we have a distraction right now. Let's just go ahead and do it, since we're already... Not friends with Raja Morn. We'll just become even lesser of a friend of Raja Morn. Oh, sir. And they still come after me. <laughs> That's not right. All right. Well, let's get back to breakfast. Actually, I'm going to go through this desk real quick and get spotted. But I need that wood. I need this. And... A ga... ga what? Garroting wire watch. A garroting wire watch. A garret is something that you... Is like a wire, and you wrap it around someone's neck, of course, and, uh, well, choke them out. <laughs> Why would I have a garroting wire watch? It's not a weapon, because if it were, it would show me some weapon stats. Interesting. I'm going to dump this contraband in here for now, so I'm not using up my fake shoe. And the toothpaste, by the way, can be used... To cover up those cameras, which I had forgotten about. That's pretty sweet. Pretty sure that was always a thing. I don't know. But some of you had mentioned it in the comments, and I was like, oh, right, yeah, toothpaste. We can use that to cover cameras. Hey, Elbra, what's up? Brah. Brah. I need a lighter. Can you hook me up? Sure, I can do that. Oh, there's a stain right outside the evil villain's mansion. I wish he would come out and say hey. Positively shocking, Walton. That moron prowler blocked my cell transfer. Drop a beat down. Nah. Sorry, Walton. I don't think I can do that. Let's drop a mop. And let me go get my contraband and bring it back real quick. We need that wood to make a brace, remember? Lazy Boy! A.K.A. George Lazy Boy. The actor that played... Oh, wait. It's over here. I'm not sure who Sean Connery is. Sean Connery. Sean. Connery. Yes. He made a great bond, you say. And I wish... I was hoping that he'd be represented in this game. Sean Connery. <laughs> Alright, let's dump this in here. Uh, right there. Panarium barrel we should just give away. Leave this in here for now. Make the brace later. And a tubby of a toothpaste. Oh, we have a lighter right here for somebody. Ooh, nice. And a razor blade for Piaz. 
Chen's poster from Crane. Let's go check. Wait, did I check Crane's desk yet? I don't think so. All right, I don't have the rest of the stuff. Let's go check Crane's desk. It's right here. Oh, it does work. Only problem is it doesn't help when the guards come traipsing around. Hello, Blondie. Daniel Craig. Blondie. <laughs> he is, of course, the current James Bond. Ooh, razor blade. I need that. Now look at all the toothpaste. Oh, wow, though. You only get two squirts out of it. Shaving cream is way better, I must say. Oh, my tube of toothpaste broke. <laughs> oh, and another lighter, and I want that. Afternoon roll call. Do I have any contraband on me? No. All right, well, we'll just go with what we have. We should be okay. Lazy boy, get to roll call. You know how the evil villain is. Where's everybody going? You're going the wrong way. Here we be. No distractions right now, right? No. Where's where's my bud Elbra? There he is. Hey, buddy. Here's a lighter for you. Try not to burn the place down, okay? Walton and Morn. Roger Moore. There he is. Not a good friend. Blondie, jack my roll of toilet paper. Get it back, and I'll see you right, bro. Okay, Chen. Not sure who Chen is. Uh, what do we have here? Ooh. Crowbar. Oh, my shoe is gone. Dang it. It fell apart, and now I don't have it anymore. I need to make another one or find another one, and I'm not really sure if we can make them. With the crowbar, we can make a pickaxe. In case we bump into any more rocks, we can also get through uh, walls. I'm going to take it. I'm going to buy that. Thank you, Crane. You know what? I probably should have given him something first. Um, anyway, Piers. Piers Bronson. Piers Bronson. Have you a razor blade? Really? I'm not jiving you. I need that for sure. And oh, baby, baby, baby. We can make a poster. Let's give Blondie. Oh, actually, wait. What's, what's my bud problem? I'm trying to get this guy to be my friend, but he doesn't really. OMG, thank you. I guess he likes that. Everybody loves a drum. Go beat on it, would you? And a file. Hmm. File. All right, I'm going to buy that foil for 29 because I think we can make a super duper pouch. Hold on. Let's go see where this is. So there's the contraband pouch. It's foil and duct tape. We can make that. There it is. Last page. Durable contraband pouch is two foil and a duct tape. So there. So now we can make that. We don't have to worry about the shoe. Elbra. Oh, you're selling stuff now too. Rope. Hmm. Interesting. And Chen. Uh, ooh, screwdriver would be nice, but... I don't have any vents to get into at this point, so I'm not going to bother. I'm good. But I want the pikeys. All right, it's a free period. We're going to have to make a run for it, since I don't have any way to get through this without setting it off. There we go. But if we beat all the guards down here, no one will be the wiser. And now, let's go ahead and let's just drop that for a moment. Let's grab that, and I can make my contraband pouch. Although, maybe I should just look around for a shoe first. You know, let's go through some desks right now. I might get lucky and find a shoe. So let's do that before I use up that duct tape, because it seems extremely rare. All right, let's do it. Did I go through Blondie's desk yet? I may have. No! Oh, look, he's got Chen's TP. And a bomb surprise? Two bombs! Whoa, what was he planning, Blondie? You gotta blow stuff up. I think a bomb surprise might work like one of those elf bangers. That's my guess. Ooh, a bomb surprise? <laughs> well, let's tuck those away in the desk for future use and reference, perhaps. Uh, that's very nice. TP. What do we want to use the TP for? Let's just get rid of the toilet paper. And let me just check the... Oh, yeah. Crane. we got to check Crane's desk. Oh, this one's still disabled. I love it. Uh, it's not there, so it's on Crane's body. Um, which means... We can either wait for Crane to get knocked out. Yeah, alright. We'll do that. No big deal. Come on, camera. Look the other way for two seconds. Would you... Oh, forget it. Because my toothpaste it broke. Oh, wood. Can't go wrong with wood. Yeah, we already checked Walton's desk, right? Camera's disabled, so that would be a good indication. Um, 
yeah, let's just put the wood down here, and then we're gonna go to the other side and see if we can find a fake shoe. We just might get lucky. Hairspray. What do we do with hairspray, I wonder? A lighter and hairspray, we can probably create a fire somehow. <laughs> uh, or maybe it makes a bomb, I don't know. Let's just try it real quick and see what happens. <gasps> flamethrower! It makes a flamethrower! Hairspray and a, a lighter makes a flamethrower. Are you kidding me? Look at the weapons here. We have bombs and flamethrowers. Yowza! All right, let's get moving. We should probably be digging and hiding that stuff right now, but it's my intelligence. 52. Let's go check a few desks on the other side. Oh, it's Lazy Boy, and who's this? Elbra. Lazy Boy got on nothing. Look at all the guards. Uh, shucks. 81 heat. It's pretty high, actually. Plunger! Ooh, what can I do for you? Distraction, evening meal. For Morn. For Morn! Wow. He still likes me enough to have me do some jobs for him. That's cool. Let's get that camera. And we got Elber's desk. And he's got some books. Yeah. Nothing. Nothing really. Oh, magazine's always lovely in a do 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 note. Do 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 nut for the blondie man. Boop. And should I do one more? I'm not gonna make it. 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 Stun pen. Nice. And a do 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 and a do do donut. Oh no, I can't get through here. Yes, I can. Wee. Forgot that that's an actual weapon. Oh, look, it's lazy boy. Uh oh. Oh, it's meal time. I thought it was roll call. Okay. We're not missing anything. Not missing anything. Except maybe a lovely corn dog. I'll sit next to Blundy. Chen. What do you want? Pack of playing cards. Oh! I think I have one back at my desk. Do I have a distraction right now? Oh, I have a distraction right now. Shucks. Four more, and guess what? Oh, I was gonna whack more. <laughs> distract distraction from Warren by whacking Warren. Oh, why am I the only one taking my clothes off through the shower? Everybody else keeps their tuxes on. Uh, that was awkward. I thought we were streaking, guys. Let's go streaking. Because I'm the only one. Need a jar of ink. Oh, yeah. These are the easy jobs. I like it. Why aren't there any ladies in something? Ugh. That's good. Shower block. Okay, now we can all take our tuxes off. I have so many friends. Am I in the shower? Come on. Let's clean off. Rinse. Who wants a dono donut? I think Prowler likes these do do donuts. Walton, my friend, what's up? Grab the guard's attention next morning. Oh man. Okay. A lot of distractions going on. Are you guys actually accomplishing anything? I wonder. Didn't bring my scuba gear. Ooh, Prowler's selling. Oh, Prowler! See now I'm thinking I should have made that dang contraband pouch. Well, if we're gonna get caught with contraband, we might as well buy as much as we can right now. <laughs> Even in free time. And I'm gonna have to take take the penalty running through the contraband detector here, guys. What is my intent? You know what? Actually, before we do that, just like Boogie said, we gotta, we gotta smarten up, kid. <laughs> he must be a member of the super undercover clandestine spies club, right? Yeah, I think he's a lifetime member of Sucks. That boogie. Oh, wow, we're above 60 now. That's great. Let's get one more. All right, 64. Now let's hustle it back. Oh, dear. I'm going to let him go through first. Odell figures. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I gotta run past them real fast. There they come. Okay. Oh, man. Super cool. Benjamin. Get out of here, guys. Look at where they all come from. There goes Odell. Okay, I only have one to Deke. Maybe he went up instead of down. Yeah, he did. Whew. Okay. 
Let's make it right now since I can. Whoops, I need that. Oh no, I can't. Oh, rats. All right. Oh, no, no I need 70 intelligence. Are you kidding me? That's insanity. Look at all this stuff, guys. Oh, man. I'm going to get rid of the glass shard. I don't really need it. Uh, let's make a timber brace right now. I'm going to need that anyway. Smart enough to do that. I'm going to cut back on some of this stuff if we can. I can make it... Oh, I need a file for a two-handle. I should have grabbed one. You can make a pickaxe. Hopefully, we'll be offered another file. I need a jar of ink and playing cards for somebody, right? Oh, hot diggity dog. Um, oh... Gotta wait for my heat to go down. I don't want to go do some more studying because I was told to smarten up. Uh, let's get it down below 90. Uh, okay. Man, heat does not dissipate around here very quickly, does it? Morn, what's up? Oh, Morn, talk to me, man. I haven't got all day. Oh. Playing cards for Chen. Ink for Lazy Boy. Alright, let's see if we can make it to 70. I doubt it, because we're just about ready for roll call. Oh, dang it. Roll call. I better go. I better go. I can't get caught or yelled at. Oh, man, it's so close, too. Oh! Oh, it's so close! Playing cards for Chen. Ink for Lazy Boy. Elber's planning a breakout. We'll keep it down, man. Chop, chop. Wait, you can't call the names out yet. Nobody's here. Elber and Prowler. Okay. Hey, lazy boy, I have your jar of ink. And where's Chen? Oh, I need that file. Oh, but it's gonna cost me big time. I don't have a choice. I need it. I need it badly. All right, Crane, do I have anything for you? I don't. All right, well, I'm going to have to buy it anyway. I was going to try to get the price down a little bit, but I'll, I'll take it. Take it off your hands. Where is Chen? There he is. Chen, come here. Take your playing cards. Yes, cool. Cool indeed. Eating meal, distraction, very good. And Chen, jar of ink. Can I get two... Before they close the doors? Oh, I don't know. Let's try it. One. Two. They close the doors. I'm caught outside. I'm, I'm dead. I'm a dead. I'm a dead man. I'm a dead man. I'm a dead man. I'm a dead man. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. No. I'm in. I'm in. Whew. Beat me now, fool. I don't care. Because I'll come right back. Alive and well. Actually, I'll probably put me right in bed. You coming in? Hey! That's not very nice. <laughs> now get out of here. I got stuff to do. Are you kidding me, Shelby? You're going to chill out in, in here? Oh, no. That's not right. Guys, Super Cole, call your little partner. Oh, my luck. All right. What is my intelligence? Let's make this right now. Contraband pouch. Super duper contraband pouch. There. 100%. And super durable, which means it won't lose as much durability when we go through the detector. Should I give this guy a bomb surprise or a flamethrow him? I'm, I'm thinking about it. I'm serious. I don't want him here. Uh, pickaxe. This is great. Getting rid of a lot of contraband right now. Maybe I can use my garret on him. Take him out. One shot. Flimsy pickaxe. All right, this is great. Cutting down on the contraband. I'm afraid if I take him out... Although... Oh! Oh, no. Can I, can I make putty? Yes! Yes! Uh, should we try a bomb surprise on him? I'm just curious what will happen. I don't want to blow the whole place up or hurt myself. All right, let's do it. I don't want to lose that. And, okay. Maybe I can get his guard outfit. And we can get a key mold. Hey, uh, excuse me, Shelby. 
Can you hold this, please? Tick, 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 tick. <laughs> Knocked him out cold. That's fantastic. And I got his little suit. I got a henchman outfit now. He didn't have a key, though. Look at his naked little body. So I thought you weren't human or something. I thought maybe it was like an Oompa Loompa. Oh, one of those little henchmen, uh, minions. But apparently, no, that's not the case. He's like a real human in a henchman suit. Well, now we know that they're real and that they bleed and you can knock them out with bomb surprises. Yeah, so it is like an elf banger, except it's a henchman banger. And I wonder if the flamethrower does the same thing. When he wakes up, I'm going to zap him with that. Well, that's excellent. As long as we don't get the shake now, we're going to get some of the stuff underground. But I cannot dig or I can't even pick this up with him in here. So I... Oh! What's up? What's up? I'm curious where he's going to go. You, you better get out of here. I'm trying to get some sleep, Shelby. Go put some clothes on, pervert. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, oh, wait a minute. Should we dig now? I don't know. That was a really good day. I'm tired and pooped. And let's let's just move some stuff down. Um, oh, wait. Actually, grab that brace. Let's put the brace up. Oh, crud. There. At least now we have the brace. <gasps> what the? Odell. I guess they don't look in the doors here. Oh my gosh, if you saw that hole, that would, that, would, that, would, that would be it. All holes lead to adventure. They know it too, you know. And they don't like it. Alright, I'm done. That was scary. More chances. Tomorrow, I'll dig. We'll dig tomorrow during the day, free period, night or something like that. I don't know yet. <sighs> okay, I'm done. <laughs> Good night. We'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Bye-bye.